If a team believes there has been a violation of the Jessup rules during a round, it must notify the bailiff in writing within five minutes of the conclusion of the round. The team should give the complaint to the bailiff while you are deliberating. At the proper time, the competition administrator will address the complaint, often by interviewing the teams, judges, and perhaps other witnesses. Complaints are not often made, but in such instances, that is the procedure that should always be followed. The team writes the complaint down, hands the complaint to the bailiff, and the bailiff gives it to the administrator. One complaint that frequently arises relates to so-called conflicts between judges and teams. According to the Jessup rules, you should not judge a round involving a team from a school with which you have an affiliation, acquaintance, or other role which would create an appearance of impropriety, except in situations disclosed to and approved by the executive director. In practice, this happens extremely rarely. Please note that merely being an alumnus of a school does not create a conflict or violate this rule. You should only recuse yourself if you have a relationship with someone affiliated with a team that you believe will prevent you from fairly and impartially judging the match or create an appearance of impropriety. If you know of a conflict that you have in advance, just notify the administrator of your competition and she won't schedule you to judge that team. If you don't realize that there is a conflict until the round is just about to begin, for instance, you see the face of one of the team members and realize it's your favorite nephew, just tell the president you need to recuse yourself, quickly exit, and return to the judge's room and tell the administrator that you need to be substituted.